You're watching Eyewitness News in high definition. She's already the world's oldest living person, but today Gertrude Baines had another reason to celebrate at her convalescent home in Jefferson Park. It's her 115th birthday. Eyewitness News reporter Melissa McBride was there for the party. Happy birthday. Gertrude Baines didn't think she'd live to be 115 years old and earn a spot in the Guinness Book of World Records. The oldest person living is Gertrude Baines. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Cool. But make no mistake, Gertrude is the world's oldest living person who clearly still has a sense of humor. Lucille Fayal is Gertrude's best friend. She loved Jerry Springer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she liked him. She used to like the soap operas too. She loved the soap operas too. She used to watch that every day. Gertrude's also a Dodger fan. She got a jersey and a Dodger dog for her birthday. You'd think she'd stuck to a healthy diet in order to live this long, but her doctor says it's her spirit that she's kept in shape. She told me that she owes her long her longevity to the Lord. That she never did drink, she never did smoke, and she never did fool around. Gertrude outlived her husband and daughter by several decades. She lived on her own until she was 105 and then came here to the Western Convalescent Hospital after she suffered a broken hip. Her only complaint to me, well there are two complaints. Number one, she doesn't like the bacon, it's not crisp enough. And the other thing is she fusses about her, fusses about her arthritis of her knees. Her secret to keeping her skin so supple all these years might surprise you. Wrinkle cream is not part of the regimen. She told me she washed her face in cold water. Happy birthday, Mrs. As for the future, Gertrude hopes to live another four years so she can vote for Barack Obama for a second term. In Jefferson Park, Melissa McBride, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Ah, happy birthday. She looks pretty in pink. She looks fantastic and a beautiful day for Gertrude. For